centre, John Bryant, is living proof of the value of hard work and dedication. The man, nicknamed Big Country by his high school coach, always had talent for basketball. But before he could turn pro, he had to lose a lot of weight. Uh, it was definitely a, a huge effort on my part, um, just basically changing my habits and you know, when I was a little kid, I'd always snack and eat, you know, everything in the house. So, you know, I'd go into the kitchen and find whatever I could and go sit down and watch TV. And, you know, I just had horrible habits back when I was younger. And, you know, now that I've educated myself about, you know, just healthier habits and, you know, just reading a lot of books and watching, you know, documentaries about, you know, just food that you eat and how, you know, just how to be a healthier person. Although his decision to lose weight was mainly a lifestyle choice, it soon exerted a big positive impact upon his blossoming basketball career. I think I did it for myself foremost, just to be healthier and you know live longer and you know just have a better quality of life. But also it helped a lot in basketball, and you know I saw the you know the benefits of losing weight and being able to play a lot more minutes and be a little bit faster. So you know it was definitely a huge effort on my part and. You know, I think it, uh, it, it all paid off. Even now, the 27-year-old from California has to work hard and make sacrifices to make sure he stays in top physical condition. I have to watch it every day. You know, it's um, uh, just every day eating and every day exercising and making sure, I, you know, I don't go out there and eat fast food or eat, you know, just a lot of, you know, pasta or any kind of just, like, you know, carbs are unhealthy, like breads and stuff like that, that, you know, I try to stay away from and, you know, just try to stick to fruits and vegetables and, you know, proteins and stuff like that. Of course, over the years, Bryant has also been able to use his size to his advantage on the basketball court. In the games when I'm playing people, they always, man, I can, I can never get around you. I can't, I can't get around you. You're, you're just impossible to get around. And, you know, that's, that's huge for when you're, you know, on defense, uh, boxing somebody out and getting the rebound. And, you know, huge on offense, too. When you get into the paint, you know, it's hard for people to move you and try, hard to, for people to get around you. Midway through last season, Bryant shed a little more weight when he made the bold decision to give his trademark flowing long hair a severe chop. It was kind of weird. I had, because back home, my cousin cuts my hair and, um, he was, he was visiting me from the States and he was here and I kind of just got the idea, man, it, like it got in my face a bunch of times during games and it was just, you know, just a hassle to, you know, wash and, you know, keep the upkeep on it was just a little, getting a little too much. So, you know, one night I was just like, hey, let's go buy some clippers and, you know, let's cut my hair. And he was like, do you really want to? You really want to? And I was like... Yeah, let's just do it. Let's just do it. And, you know, I got, got kind of nervous on the first, you know, when he turned on the clippers and then started going for it. I was like, uh, wait for it. Uh, yeah, right, just go for it. 